KTSM 9's Mutt Mondays, sponsored by the Animal Services of El Paso. Well, tomorrow just so happens to be your chance to put some of your creative talents to good use and help our local shelter pets at the same time. Also, some of these pets pretty talented themselves. You have a chance to bid on their own works of art. Jessica Novato joining us now from El Paso Animal Services with more details alongside that's Courtney. Courtney, yes. <laughs> uh, thank you. Thank you for stopping by. So yes, tomorrow you. is really the big day. Yes, yeah, so tomorrow is Inspire Your um, Heart with Art Day. Mm -hmm. So, um, of course, we are encouraging the public to, to get crafty. Um, there are many uh, resources on our, our website with, um, you know, household items, recycled items such as toilet paper rolls, uh, newspaper, and you can create enrichment um, at home for your pets, or you can bring them down to the shelter and donate them to ours. <laughs> <laughs> So these are just little crafts you can make, little toys and things for them to chew on and yeah, yeah. pass the time? Yeah, uh yeah. -huh. So <laughs> uh, definitely enrichment. It's like a mental exercise for the pets uh, that we yeah. use. Um, it's a tool that we use at the shelter. So um, using these recycled items at home, um, you know, get crafty, make some, and um, bring them to the shelter. We'll, we'll definitely put them to use. And uh, the other big part of tomorrow, Tuesday, is uh, the artwork itself that you can actually bid on, created by our own local shelter pets. Yes, so um, we are partnering up with uh, Friends of El Paso Animal Services um, to bid off these uh, artworks um, <laughs> that, that, that were made by our shelter pets. Uh, you know, we <laughs> can see some paw prints. Um, yesterday we, we did have an event with our rescue runners mm -hmm. and we were able to create some works of art with our uh, shelter pets. It looks really, it looks really nice. <laughs> yeah, you can I see. I was joking, it looks like a, a Jackson Paw look a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Yes, that's a good one. <laughs> uh, and Courtney had a, a hand or a paw in creating some of these, we think, right? Yeah, somewhere somewhere in there is, is a little bit of Courtney's um, work, <laughs> definitely. Um, and she is looking for a home. Um, you said you she's know. about four years old. Yes, yeah, she's about four years old. Um, I don't know if you could tell, but she's a little bit smaller. Um, yeah. She's about 30 to 40 pounds. Um, so she's definitely going to be a cuddle buddy for somebody. Um, she's very, very sweet. <laughs> and maybe she'll come with a, her work of art here. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. <laughs> uh, did you say about how many paintings are available? Um, so we do have quite a few. I, I believe it's about 10 okay. uh, works of art. Yeah. So uh, then there's a, a smaller ones that we also had with our um, children. We had a camp oh, and they yeah. came down and they were able to um, actually uh, interact with our pets and, and do some more of these uh, okay. works of art. <laughs> uh, if people want to learn more information about uh, inspiring your heart with art tomorrow, where can they go? So they can definitely check out our website. Uh, we do have a virtual learning library that they can um, see the, the different art um, pieces that they can do at home. And um, you know, just check us out on social media as well. We'll be auctioning them off. All right, Jessica and Courtney, thank you so much for the time. As always, always a pleasure having you guys stop by. Thank you for having us. We'll be right back, so stay tuned.